Hi guys, Laura here. I'm here today to do my one of my book hauls. This week, well the past week, was very insane with bookish related fun. I went to BookCon and then a couple of days before that I went to um, BloggerCon, which is for book bloggers. So I'm going to do my haul from that first and then I will do my BookCon haul, which will probably be in a couple of parts because I got a lot of stuff from it. Um, and I'm going to tell you guys all the books that I got um, and a little bit about BloggerCon at the end. And do some summaries if I can, if I know what they're about. Sometimes I don't, but most of the time I do. So the first book that I got from the BloggerCon, the way that BloggerCon works is that you went to like two panels and you got to choose them. I went to Quiet Eye, YA, and How to Promote Your Blog. And then they opened up like a room full of arcs and you got to pick whatever you wanted. So that's where most of these came from. And then I won a trivia contest and that's where three of them came from. And I'll show you guys what they are when I get to them. Um, but the first book that I picked up from Source Books is called Darker Side by Lena Renee Heber. And this book's actually already out, so it's not an arc. Um, and it's about this girl who, um, she is trapped in a painting, I think. And the person that trapped her um, is a painter and he can inexplicably trap them trap people in paintings so it looks really really cool and hopefully I will get to read it soon and when I do I will give you guys my thoughts um the next book I got was one I was very excited for this color is so pretty it's called breaking and it's about this girl named Charlotte and she is in a prep school and when two of her friends wind up commute committing suicide within a month of each other she suspects something is just not right and she falls down a hole of mysteries and conspiracies. Um, and there is suspense and danger at every turn. And this is a suspense and it's a thriller. This is from Bloomsbury. It comes out June 6th. But this cover is so pretty. And this is one I will definitely be reading um, relatively sooner because I love reading mysteries in the summer. Um, and then the next book I got from this haul was The Possible by Tara Alberano, um, and this book also comes out June 6th, um, and this is about a teen explores her dark family past and the dangerous power of Will in this novel from the acclaimed author of The Leaving, um, and it's about this girl named Kaylee whose mother Crystal committed suicide um, because she claimed that she was a telekinetic, um, but when a woman shows up on the door um, to ask for an interview to see if she, Kaylee, is telekinetic. Um, she experiences some weird things that maybe take out or maybe she's losing her mind. Um, and again, this is also another psychological thriller, so I'll definitely be reading this soon. Um, but yeah, I'll definitely give you my, and it comes out June 6th, and it is from Bloomsbury. I love psychological mysteries that have like a hint of supernatural. I think that they're so cool. Um, and then another book is another contemporary, and it's Internet Famous by Denetica Stone, and this comes out June 2017, and this is published by Swoon, Swoon Reads, um, and she also wrote All the Feels. And this is about an internet station, Madison Nakama. Um, she has a massive following, um, but when internet, um, and she's a very, very popular blogger, but internet fame has its price. And when some things in her life start to go wrong, it starts to affect her blog, and she has to find a way to get out of it. It sounds really, really cute, and I'll definitely be reading this one soon again because it's a contemporary, and I love to read contemporaries in the summer. That's a really cute cover. Um, and then the other one I'm seeing is Love and Other Alien Experiences by Carrie Whiffrey. This is also another um, Fool Fool and Friends book, which is a, um, a thing of Macmillan, I think, or Bloomsbury. I um, mean, this is, um, comes out in July. Um, this is another, um, contemporary novel that has to deal with, um, a girl who, a father suddenly goes missing and she doesn't want to leave her house, but she unexpectedly gets nominated as prom queen and some interesting things happen. So I'm really excited to see what this is all about. Um, and the next one has one of the best titles in this haul. Wesley James Ruined My Life by Jennifer Homburn, and this comes out July 2017. Um, and this is Quinn is having a really, really rough summer, 
but an unexpected void that she knew from her past comes back in time to shake everything up. And Quinn has to realize, does she want the boy or does she want... Um, does she want the boy or does she want to have an easy summer? So we'll see what this is about too when this comes out in July. Um, and the next book um, I have is actually the sequel. It's the second book um, in the Razorland series and this is Vanguard. I haven't read um, Vanguard yet but I definitely will and this comes out in July. Um, and then this next book, it comes out in August um, 2017 and this is called The Wood. Um, by Chelsea Bowiski, and it's about a girl who her father is the guardians of the woods. But when her father goes missing, it becomes her mission to figure out why her father went missing and what is really in the woods. Kind of sounds a little bit like the village to me, but we'll see. Um, and then this was another one. This is this is one of the books that I won from the um, from the trivia contest, and it's called Timeless. Um, Diego and the Rangers of Basilica, and this is actually a really cool book because it's written. But it also has really in-depth pictures in it. So, and this is called, like, a um, past, present, and future worlds collide in this epic fantasy adventure series. Welcome to the new world of Timeless. So, and it's really cool. Just, I love the pictures in it. So I'm very excited to read this. And this is another one that I got from the trivia contest. And I was so excited to get this. And this is Meet Cute. Some people are destined to meet. And it's an anthology of stories by Jennifer Alamachout, Daniela Clayton, Katie Catino, Jocelyn Davis, Hunsley Fitzpatrick, Nina LaCour, Emily Lord, Catherine McPhee, Cass Morgan, Julie Murphy, Meredith Russo, Sarah Shepard, Nicola Yoon, and E.B. Zobi. And it's just adorable. I started reading this on the train ride home and I fell in love with it. I doubt I'm going to be able to wait till January to read this, but I really, really want to. So I really, really want to read it soon and I probably will because it's a contemporary, so I'll probably read it this summer. The last book I got from the book haul was Phoenix Rising. Um, and this is a pirate-themed novel, and it comes out, um, 117. So it comes out, um, yeah, so it comes out in a bit. But yeah, I'm really, really excited to read this all. And the last thing I got from this haul was an audiobook, Labyrinth Lost, by, um, Zoraida Cordova. And she was actually there. She was one of the people that was, like, running it. So I'm really excited to finally read this and find out what happens in this novel. Those are all the books that I got from BloggerCon. I'm definitely going to plan to read some of these quickly, so you guys will have to keep an eye out for my blog that I've linked below, and that's called Laura's Bookish Corner. Also, I will be putting all these reviews on my Book Likes blog, but my my personal blog will have a lot more tag-related things. I hope you guys are having a great day, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!